Welcome back to Ecosidum Gaming and our playthrough of the Horizon Zero Dawn DLC, The Frozen Wilds. Back with Aloy in Song's Edge. And uh, we have another little stranger side quest over there that we're going to do in today's episode. But before we get there, we have four skill points. So we are going to spend that on, um, let's see, I need to get Strong Strike first, since we have three of those, we'll get Leader Strike next time, Strong Strike Plus, and then Quiet Sprint. We'll finish out all of these skill trees uh, eventually. They shouldn't have closed out of that because we do have new treasure boxes to check out. Got some metal shards, large machine cores, and a weapons coil modification. Hmm. What was that? Untested weapon coil. That is from Burgund. Damage, tear, and fire. So we can put that on our regular bow. Hmm. I think we'll clear that. And install that. Hell yeah, that is going to really make that a very worthwhile weapon to be wielding. <laughs> 151 damage with our hard tip arrows. That is nice. <clears throat> okay. Uh, what else? Special items. We gathered two more of those in the previous episode. Those are all wraps. Got a squirrel skin and an owl bone. Should probably sell some more items to the uh, trader since we are at 119 out of 120 capacity. <laughs> a little far jump, Aloy. Shouldn't have gone down quite that far. Is it this one that we want to talk with? Yeah, we'll take what we are selling. So, that. Um, polished Ancient Charm. Animal Talisman. That. Or Luminous Braiding. Hmm. Watch her heart. Okay. Looking for any fives. Let's see what's next to them. Metal blocks. So a bit of blaze. Holy crap, we have a lot of metal vessels. So we'll sell a bunch of those. Sell some meat. Um, sell some wire. Um, shock rack root. Fire kiln root. Corruption clays root. So all marked items. Mm, we still have quite a few. Mm. <coughs> Sorry. Um, what else can we sell? Well, 
it's easy enough to find rabbit, turkey, and fox in the rest of the world. And boar. So we'll sell all of those as well. Um, boar, rabbit. There we go. That gives us plenty of space for gathering more resources. How about here? Uh, let's sell that fire coil. Sell that one too. Sell that one because it's below. And we'll sell that one too. And that handling coil. Don't need to at 38. Mm. Okay, that looks good. Hmm. All right. <laughs> Now, let us see about this new little stranger quest. We have all of our ammo ready to go. Good. Alright. In a toot. As we are bound by laws, you are bound by wire. Yet your crime was the act of killing. So we must drive you out, away from the Warek, from protection, from our songs. My chieftain, Coppola, am I not your favorite fighter? Do you not recognize me from this tooth you knocked out? How many times have I pulled you from danger by your neck, made excuses for your behavior? <sighs> you are my favorite. But the shaman is decided. While you wait for exile, think on what brought you here. A test of strength! Who among us would refuse a challenge from an outlander? Not I! But I did not kill him! Hush, hush. You can tell your story to the ice. Ah. <sighs> uh. You took Artok's mantle. It's mine now. I would like to see that fight. They said that you killed someone. Perhaps I did. If even my chieftain accepts it, it must be so. That's not the way it works for me. Want to tell me your story? I did fight with the Karja Hunter to settle a challenge. That much is true. He was strong and damn quick. We traded punches. Good punches. Hard punches. And the next thing I remember... Gray morning light, and the Karja beside me, with his head broken open. But the blow was not by my hand. So everyone knows you started the fight with this man? Of course. For honor, I'll fight anyone. If, if I wasn't bound, I'd fight to prove myself right now. I don't think that would help you. This is what I am. Each runner in the Warwick has a gift. I brawl. None can take a punch, a fall better than I can. Until this time, I was too drunk. We were grappling, he clapped my ears. I took one last swing as I went down, but not a killing blow. It can't have been. Isn't your Warak supposed to support you? At least give you the benefit of the doubt? When our Warak had caused a quarrel, I was a solution. To fight for its honor and win, they'd call on me. Or, when they needed someone to lose, for appearances, I could do that too. Now when Outlander is murdered without honor, all eyes are on me. I have become my Warwick's shame. They don't want an incident with the Karja, so you take the fall. That is what I do best. 
And for your punishment, they'll exile you from the Warwick? From Warwick? <coughs> March me up the slopes of the cloud shear, leave me stripped and exposed. That's awful. If I survive, the land has absolved me. That's the law. It must be accepted. It's still awful. I'm not stupid. I don't like my chances either. I can't fight a mountain. I'll be honest. You haven't got a good defense, Inatut. I've heard that one before. Where did the fight happen? A clearing, just outside the Karja Outlanders camp. You should talk to them. They wouldn't hear me out. They say no one else could have been there, other than me and the dead man. The shaman consulted the signs in the snow and agreed. I'll see what I can find out. And I'll be back. I'll be here. What else am I gonna do? Until the horn gives a call from my exile. Okay. So map no quests side quests activate show on map all right it's a ridiculously short distance to fast travel but Huntress, what business do you have with us? I was asked to look into the murder of a Karja hunter. What happened? It's plain as day. A drunk Banuk thug picked a fight with Ruas, struck him down from behind and stole his headdress. The accused man says that he didn't do it. You're not going to get anything useful out of the Banuk, whether they talk to you or don't. They gather up like cloaks in a chill wind every time a hunter dies out here. Won't even hand Ruas's killer over for a proper trial. A proper trial. To fill his mouth with salt, and hold him up for the sun to consider over days. If it is clement, it may only take his sight, or his wits. So other Karja hunters have died in these lands before? Three, maybe four in the last few seasons. That's no surprise. This place punishes even the prepared, and many young nobles don't prepare. But usually, the snow covers everything, and the bodies are never found. No thanks to the Banuk. Do you think they're involved? No. If it's not about their tribe, they don't want to get involved. In these outlands, even the sun cannot thaw all it touches. Doesn't sound like you trust the Banuk much. They're not without their reasons to keep apart from us. Ten years of reasons. Oh, it's the war. The war is over. We made amends, but no. The land never forgets. Snow and ice keep memory, they say. It takes time for scars to heal. You think I don't know that? I still bear the lashes for refusing one of the Mad King's sun priests. I was your age then. Uh, times of shadow. Times of shadow. Where did you find Ruas's body? There's no hunt, girl. Nothing to pick up. Humor me. I'm a good tracker. Down the rise to the west, there's a clearing. But a grazer herd couldn't have trampled it better. And if that barbarian gives up Ruas's headdress before they cast him out, let me know. It's valuable. Okay. Go to the clearing. This is it. Snow's been disturbed a lot. Like that blood on the snow. Mm. That was used for the killing blow. Now oh, here's something. All right. This is where Ruas fell. It does seem that only two people fought here. Not looking good for Inatut. Didn't try to hide the weapon. Question is, is Inatut the kind of fighter who hits from behind with a tree branch? Lots of leaves and bark scraped off here. When someone pulled out the branch, 
No. From climbing it. They came through the trees. I like the track. <laughs> this is one of those things that I wish was in more games. Use of climbing trees. camp and the clearing okay Do need to follow the trail <clears throat> Continue on our track. It's not just more bridge. And another campfire discovered, which is good. These are on route. Well, this is ominous. A dead end? Can't be. Hmm. Investigate the area. What am I investigating for? I forget. Hello. Maybe I can trade this blue gleam. Blue gleam. Always talking about the blue gleam. We select that. So hopefully it will. something else. Is this a black crate over there? Hmm.
It's not a very good blockade. That's all it takes. Your armor. This looks bad. Not Banook, then she won't be missed. She's coming for us. Yes, she is. You're not gonna dodge me, chick. Not a good shot. <laughs> right in the face. Missed. That was a good shot in the face. <laughs> You've been killing Karja. And for what? Revenge for the war? Who gets to declare that one tribe no longer hates another? I'll tell you. Not the ones who fought. Not the ones whose songs are silenced. But my kin. For what you did, another Banuk has been sentenced to certain death. What about his song? Oh, that's why you followed us. For that punch-drunk idiot in a toot. Fate is sharp today. They've already let him out to face his exile. Let's see who the cold claims first. I need to go after Inatut. But I should find some more evidence first. Is that another? Yeah, that's another medicinal herb. Good. to Ruas, so it was a Karja soldiers. Not that it's any excuse. Okay. Did they keep any clothes from their victims? Um. This hmm? Karja gear's not warm, but if Inatut's naked on a snowfield, he'll take what he gets. Okay, time to get moving. Okay, uh, first off. Restock some. No! Ah, too far. Didn't mean to jump. I was thinking I had to jump. I have a tendency to do that on those lines. Because I don't think getting on them is going to be automatic like that. Get out of here! Two. 
this big. Uh, I'm here, Charger. Let's go. Faster, buddy. discovered. That's why I'm not fast traveling because most of this part of the map I know I haven't visited yet. Getting close to where I'm going to have to leave our Ramalama behind. I don't know if needing to climb. be an ass or are you going to stay mad at me? Oh. Oh, I forget where up is over here. Oh, so now you've come to play. you and you are going down fast there we go there we go the kind of place you'd take someone if you wanted to lose them forever I'm not getting up that frozen waterfall no nope. maybe along the side this way Aloy look up and jump this way, and now, hello. It's right there. Oh, come on, girl. There we go. Sometimes the mechanics do not work the way they should. Yeah, let's see. Until I tell you to let go. <laughs> More glowing talks. What are you groaning about, girl? That one dead. Where is this one now? Missed. I hit. All right. Halfway there. to our other carcass. Ah, yes. Our next climb takes us right to it. Huh. 
I don't mind now. Yep. Run, Aloy. Frozen solid. Mixed feelings about that. I'm going to stop to craft up the arrows. In a tit! In a tit! Maybe he found shelter? I hope he found shelter. Behind the rock. <clears throat> the Nora girl? Is it really you, or has the bone chill got through my skull? I found the real killers. No one else has to die because of this. Take these. A dead Tarsus close. Haven't I been beaten down enough? But I won't argue. All right. I swear, thought I'd saw my ancestors. They said, we're surprised you ended up here. <laughs> you better hurry. Machines. Cannot see. Hello, could we quit hitting armor, damn it? Damn 
Why are these two harder than the three that we faced when we uh, challenged uh, our attack? Well, that ain't gonna help. God damn it. Now I have to start using potions. That's not good. Why are these guys harder than the three that we took off with Aratok? some higher ground. Thank you. That effect like drained completely. ticked off because these two are just way overpowered. Uh, 
cannot see where I'm at. Hello. I can't even get out of there. Come on, Aloy. should not be able to move that fast. going down this time. Almost dead. Come on, Aloy, get the arrow out. There's one dead. to target in a tough cave for more, but... Hello. Oh, uh, is that shoulder missing already? Not shot. Say that again. He's almost dead. Freaking soft points, either. Oh, shit. <laughs> All right. Okay. Now that was a fight. The trial's <laughs> over. It was other Banuk who killed that man. Killed him because he was Karja. You know why I took the first swing at him? He challenged the honor of the Banuk. The honor. That's what I thought. Come on. Let's get you back. Once I'm off the mountain, <laughs> I'll find my own way. I need I'm to... sorry. I should have broken the ice before I That's started the conversation, but I didn't think he was behind there. I'll see you at town then. You'd better make it. All right? I give my pledge. All right. So by the nuke law, if Inatut survives, he's forgiven. 
But I want to prove to his chieftain that he wasn't guilty in the first place. Yes, we know it, boy. And we need to gather up all of the leftovers. We have quite a bit of restocking to do on our uh, medicine pouch. Seeing as we pretty much completely went through it. And still not fully healed. Saving these for the trail. Alright, anything else up here that we can grab? There's a supply crate. Yeah, okay. A little bit more. Alright. So basically we just have to head back now. Easier when I was a kid. Mm -hmm. All right. No space. I used. Guess I regained them after I died. Is that what I'm getting from that? <laughs> Alright. Come on, little charger buddy. Need to find a lot more medicinal herbs along the way. I'm not seeing any more in the hut. Before I hit too far though. What was I looking for for crafting upgrades for the pouch capacity? An owl skin and a squirrel bone. Okay. Alright. Owl skin, squirrel bone. Before we get anywhere further, we will save. I'm seeing a lot of Ridgewood. Alright, there's some more. I just find it easier to gather on foot because he has a tendency to run past what I'm trying to gather. There we go. There's some nice little supply crates. I'll tuck that away. Anything else right there? No, looks like all of those. All of those are on um, Ridgewood. Sorry. I had to pause there for a moment because uh, I had to turn my mic off while I sneezed. <laughs> and trust me, you don't want me sneezing at the mic.
Another campfire discovered. Um, that's not what I'm looking for. Yeah, that's better. One more and we could be good. Hello. There we go. Now we're running a good path. Okay. Suppose we could fast travel now, but if we're this far along, we might as well just run it. Let's see what this blue gleam is worth. We haven't actually gathered a lot of blue gleam. Well, maybe more than I think. But not enough to uh, buy anything worthwhile. Really pretty sunrise. Can I just kill something with a ram? I better not write this one. Okay, there we go. Thunder's drum in the background. That's pretty. <laughs> Inita told you the truth. This is the headdress stolen from the murdered man. You'll find more in a ravine north and west of here, along with the bodies of the killers. The exile still served its purpose. He was guilty of our suspicion. Fate has fallen like snow, and should Inatut return, he will be absolved. You can't be serious. He speaks for the Warwick, my Nora friend. You look ridiculous. If you would return to my Wirak, you will behave as a Banuk does. How does a Banuk behave, my chieftain? Like I did? Accepting a sentence for a crime he did not commit. Or those others who killed in cold blood for crimes that their carge of victims did not. I think what I wear will not make me more or less of a Banuk. For his own Warwick. sake, it would be wise for him to think less, Nora friend. I'll talk to him, but not for you. <clears throat> I defied my chieftain's will spurn my Warwick. How are you feeling? As if I've been pounded the guts. I could just keep walking, but when my anger has thawed, it will leave me with nothing. Where else would I go? Mm. If you choose to stay, it should be on your own terms. This sounds political. I'm not good with politics. More like a fighting strategy. You survived exile. I bet that doesn't happen much. I've only heard of it in Legends. You earned your place in the Warwick, Inatut. Make them earn you back. Of all my fights, this is the first time I beat death. I bow to you. It won't be the last. And my song shall grow. You'll hear of it. As for you, Nora girl, will you accept this gift? A, a little scrawny weight against the great boon you gave me, but... I'm honored. Thank you, Inatut. Okay. Three more blue gleam. Sorry, had to pause again. Level 52 reached. Let's 
skill points. Max health added 10 more. Nice. Okay, so what do we have? Treasure boxes. Another weapons coil. Nice. Still have a bunch of traps. We are two skill points to the good. Resources. Looks like we need to go visit our uh, merchant friend again. Do that right now. And then we'll call it an episode. Alright. So. So. Lindvok Heart. A regular ancient charm. Mm. Another one of those. Mm. Put your heart. Desert glass. Sell some chill water because we keep picking up more chill water. I suppose we can sell a little bit of blaze as well. Um, what else? Meat, meat, wire. Hmm. Sell the shock rack root, fire kiln root. I think that's pretty much it. Yeah. Okay. Mm. A lot of stuff we can sell there, but not going to go through all of it right now. If you have enjoyed this episode, please consider giving it a like and subscribing to see more. And Aloy and I will see you in the next one. <laughs> Bye for now.